The 6th Yangon Photo Festival featuring international and local photographers was held at the French Institute Saturday. The theme of the festival is Meta, the path to peace. The best photography and photo stories made by Myanmar photographers are shown and selected for the best prizes by international juries. Hua Wakain tells us more. The festival entered the patronage of Dong San Suu Kyi, encouraged the foreign participants to present their work and interact with their local counterparts through exhibitions, lectures and screening. Most of these uh, images are documentaries, most of the series are documentaries. And we look as a judge in these pictures, is the compositions, the storytelling. We've been doing this, I've been involved for the past six years, and every year the quality has become so much better. This year we were able to train new photographers everywhere in Myanmar. We've been uh, in Michina, in Tanji, in Dawe. So there will be uh, works from all over the country which will be shown tonight. We will have one hour program, but originally, uh, there were 67 photographers who uh, sent us their photo essay. After today's official opening, the best multimedia photo essay produced by Myanmar photographers will be shown on a wide screen to the public. This year, we provided the trainees with camera to take photos for the festival. We'll award Canon camera to the winner. Such a festival like this is a chance for photographers to show their works. This is my first time to participate. My essay is about the life of students from schools for the blind. Since I had ten days to make my photo essay, I spent my time from down to decks with them to take photos of daily routine of them. The contest really excited for me. A jury presided by Dong San Suu Kyi will award prize including Canon SLR cameras. In partnership with international media support, a wide variety of free workshops will be available for the new generation of Myanmar professional photographers as well as photo enthusiasts. Hoa Khan for Amai TV, Myanmar International Television.